So it doesn't look bad. I mean, if you want to, you can, but I mean, it's not the no, yeah, because you're the other way, right? Here we go. Okay, yeah, that's no, fine. I'm good. I already said yes. If there was like an easier option, then that's different, but you know. I think all these years I just, this whole time I've been here I have never been in this position so it's very nice to be alive. Somehow I have I have started that responsibility. So. Man, I am such a not cr Chris head. Played not Chris once and I was like godlike. I love the Ness. And I've played so many Nesses, so like, oh! What's the stream on this again? Is the stream GTS? The stream is what exactly this time GTS is. Chime for us, okay. some comfy ass commentary chairs. 1% death? That's no good. Anyhow, yeah, I'm a big uh, Not Chris fan. I'm a big Zoe fan, of course, too, but you know, for me, like Not Chris is like a much rarer thing. I, I, I have to say, I, I think the only time I've really watched Not Chris was in the Netplay bracket era. Um, but I just really liked um, his style from that. All right, that could be it. It's a really terrible situation, but I don't know if there's an easy... Oh my god, that's really smart. I did not know that was a thing in this matchup. Yeah, oh, not Chris Edgeguard's pit. I feel like he is willing to go out there. No jump. No jump. Just has to. Yep. Damn, that is awful. Not a fun situation for Ness. Right there against Floaties. Man, Ness with no resources here is so bad. I love the cross up pressure. So easy for it to take all of Ness's resources. Wow. The evasion, the, the spacing, the death. Okay, no resources from Zoe, and 
And I'm just not able to ca capitalize. Oh! Slick! That's why I'm a not Chris head right there. The, 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 sh the shimmy ya ya. The, the glide and fair, uh, nair, I mean. Oh! Okay. Interesting choice. Gets the ledge with the magnet, but still struggling to make it back to neutral, back to center. But actually, very good situation now for Nonchris. It's actually possible to take, keep this lead and really, yep. Yeah. It's hard because, like, you know, Pit wants that lead and to shoot the, shoot the arrows, and Ness can just, like, get into your face like that. Yeah, I think Lucas makes sense. Three, two, I feel like it's hard to deal, like, in terms of how not Chris plays, like, the pressure is going to be super hard to deal with, with the pit, um, so, you know, fight fire with fire. Yeah, the edge guard, lots of cool stuff, but, um, that you can do, but, wow, wow, that was crazy. It looked like Zoe got some hits in, but I was wrong, there was no hits. God, I love that fade back up there, that's so cool, out of Magnum. Certainly a better matchup for Ness, probably, in this patch, given the Lucas nerfs. Yeah, that might have been a spike in the last patch. I'm not 100% sure. Ooh, it whiffs, whiffs the punish, and this lead is getting bigger. Or not Chris. Yeah, wow, okay. What was that? <laughs> Did the stream hear that? The stream shouldn't have heard that. <laughs> that. That was Steam deciding that I needed to know about the summer sale. I thought my brain was installing an update. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I thought not Chris had no jump, but I was wrong. Yep. P PK, the PK kids have such a hateful matches, you know what I mean? It's hateful. Schoolyard brawl. Oh, 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 Zoe went too fast. Traveled into the future mentally. Jesus. Chris is so fast with a character that is like... I think Zoe was telling me, and I remember now that there were some conversations they had with him before, not, not Chris was like, could Ness ever be as fast as uh, Lucas? And Zoe was like, no. And not Chris took that personally, and just seeing it right here, he's zooming. Joy playing appropriately cautious, but what is her, what is the win con she's looking for here? Is she trying to get up? Oh, well, that was cool. I mean, Lucas has so many, obviously, but. Okay, that was the. <laughs> That's like the least likely thing in that deep of a deficit for <laughs> Lucas to get a kill from. That, like, she has to win this game now. She has to win the game. If she doesn't win the game, it's like. What was it all for? What, what did I say? What did I say? She had to win the game. After that, you have to win the game. <laughs> That's why I'm a good commentator. Because I'm just like, I feel the vibe. You know what I mean? I'm like, the energy was there.
<laughs> and Chris was playing like crazy good. Like Zoe was definitely looking like maybe the Lucas pick was feeling a little sluggish, which I'm not sure if Zoe's really struggled with that, to be honest. But it did, for whatever reason, look like uh, still adapting to the matchup. But, you know, uh, so much of it is about just as Lucas, like just figuring out where to pop off and get your kills. All right. Good weights, good weights. Sometimes I've seen not Chris like not wait for those. Um, and I think it's going to be necessary to wait for those. They're just slinking around the platforms. Yes, it is a very funny game. I would agree with that. With the pit, it was a little less funny, but the PK kid battle is so hilarious. Hmm. I'm curious, like, the risk reward now of all of uh, up smash in the new patch. Offense up, I, I, one thing that somebody, I was, when I was watching the Lunchable stream, and I'd love if anyone who understands the patch knows better, is, that, is it just um, regular up smash that got nerfed and offense up, uh, up smash is the same? Or do they both get nerfed? Oh, yo, what? Oh no, that was, that was not great. Jesus, this is, they're all going to game five. <laughs> Yeah, Joey, I'm, I'm, I'm Zoe's ride, so I am here. All right, does regular got nerf. Thanks, Moto. Pit. Back to the pit. Yeah, I mean, I have to say, I did think the pit looks more stable. The Lucas, like, had its moments, but it just looked like, for whatever reason, not Chris was able to suffocate. Oh, that's a, that's, what, what, a, what an opening. Man, I think so much about openings in video games now, in fighting games, because every game thinks about them so differently. And, you know, I guess one thing about Smash is, like, once you've balanced it out that everyone's spawning the same, uh, it's like, I don't know, there's, it's like, it's, a little, it's, it, it, it's hard to be funny, but something like Run Up Down B is hysterical. Uh, you have to, it's really about knowing what the other opponent does. And there's a lot of games where like the opening is like super, super skewed in some way or another. Like Marvel 2, I was telling Zoe about how, like imagine if, imagine if in like Smash, like when you play Falco, only character the frame one move, you can like a buffer the frame one move in the very first frame on top of somebody the moment the game starts. Uh, that's what Magneto can do in Marvel 2, it's awesome. It's sick and insane. I mean, obviously people have like invincible moves, so. I haven't seen a lot of up Bs from Zoe. Like, I don't know what, I don't know, like, enough about Pit right now and how Zoe plays a character, but there's been a few times where I was like, I wonder if a commitment to it would work. Yeah, the Pit is doing work. It feels like it's allowing Zoe to react, like, get out of not Chris's suffocating offense. Man, that's crazy. I have not been really following this scene for a while because I had been not going to turn this, so I don't know what, who Zoe's characters are in general now besides the Lucas who is always on tap. <laughs> I do hope I'm back, but we'll see. At least Tuesdays. Tuesdays is nice. This is like... Uh, there's a There was a time in my life where, <laughs> yeah, I would feel like... <laughs> Yeah, let's stay up until four and play Smash. But uh, I would love to have the ability to do that. What? But uh, I can't believe I killed him. But uh, you know, you got you got responsibilities.
I will stay up forever. I don't don't sleep anymore. Not Chris is so terrifying that I could totally see him pulling off two stocks really quick. <laughs> That's big. All right, last stock. Okay, that's... Okay, the attacking situation actually that Zoe picked was good for ending, ending that pressure. Uh-oh. Really committal down down air, and I think he might pay for it. Oh, that's that's gotta be frustrating. The shield when the shield betrays you. Oh, can that be it? Wow, just barely one percent. That magnet, the magnet that he that not Chris did literally saved him from that kill, and so he goes on to lose winners grand finals. What is it? I don't know where I am. Where am 